Hello, I'm going to show you how to create your first terrain for your first map. If you haven't got your Unreal Editor open, you go to your Start menu, then you go to All Programs, and just around these folders here, look for Unreal Development Kit. There it is there. Click on that folder, and then you'll see a version folder in underneath it. Click on that and then just double click UDK editor or create a shortcut from it send right click on it and go send to desktop create shortcut All right now when you first open the editor it looks a bit scary just close that content browser because you don't need that yet and you go straight to new map morning lighting because it's nice and red you can select them some other one if you want then you close that and you'll see I've got a nice red sky now. And to move your mouse around and look around, you right click with your mouse wheel to look left and right and move up and down. And if you want to pull up to get a high view, just look at the ground and pull back on your arrow keys. The arrow keys make you go forward and backwards uh, on your keyboard. Now we're going to delete everything in this shitty map because it's too small and it's a static mesh terrain you can't make a mountain out of it. We're going to delete everything except for this builder brush. We're not going to delete the builder brush and we're not going to delete that directional light source because without that light source we won't have clouds or, or sun. You can move that light source later on in the map so what we're going to do is first delete the player start by left clicking on it with your mouse and then hitting delete do the same with the floor left click on the floor delete and do the same with the player boundary limit click on that and delete now you go to tools up the top here and then click new terrain and 16 patches was the size of that small map we're going to make it 128 that's the size of the standard map so you put 128 in X and Y. Click Next. Ignore the layer setup. Click Finish. And it creates a new terrain. Now, that's your Builder Brush and your Directional Light Source there. Uh, now I'll show you how to alter the shape of the terrain. Make your mountains and stuff. Just go up here top left on that mountain thing which is your terrain editor and you click this thing here the paint tool that's for altering your terrain adjusting your terrain shape and painting your materials on coloring in and this here is for adjusting this little red brush here this is your paint brush this red thing moving around on the right um, 100% means strong and fast and 4% means it'll, it'll raise the mountain slowly and finely but I'll keep it on 100 where it's nice and fast now the radius is the inner radius of the circle and the fall off is your outer radius of the circle see that's just gone wider you got a cone shape hill there now if um, to make the hill, I hold the control key down on the keyboard and left click with the mouse. And it's made a cone shape hill. Now you can move it around. As you're moving you can do it. And if I want to reverse it or make a hole in the ground, just hold the control key down and right click. And that does that. Um, I'll just make a bit mountain there again. Now if I want to flatten the tops, put a flat top on it, or end up with walls on the side like a cliff, I'd click flatten just here. And um, I'll show you. Now if I put flatten on that. Hold the control, left mouse. It's just turned that into a flat top cliff because I went over the side with the outline of the red brush um, and if you want to smooth it um, you click on 
the that thing there smooth and <coughs> this is what smooth does when you left click with control it also lowers the, the bit that's on the ground there if you want to walk up that you just put the bowl in the middle near the ground move it around a bit and it'll take shape now we want to test it in game just right click on the ground and go play from here there we go and you can see I can walk up there and have a look around to see what it looks like in game and to exit out of game mode just hit escape now I'll show you how to um, how to colour it in um, before you go to colour it in make sure you've got paint selected uh, drag it out of the way and then you go to your content browser and um, just type in grass and hit all assets and it'll show grass it'll show materials of grass use materials to paint with and put color on things just click on that and it highlights make sure it's selected it's not selected if it's not highlighted that one's not selected that one is um, now you go here right click in the gray dark gray area select the second top line auto create and it'll put that grass over the whole map with the first for the first material but the second after the first material all the other materials you put in won't do that they'll they'll have to be painted on so yeah and um so i'll do the second material i'll go back to all assets type in dirt Uh, where's some dirt materials there we go there's the dirt material selected now you got that selected in the content browser now if it does this buggy shit like this computer does here it's just all disappeared just close that and reopen it and then right click in here and you take the third line down which says new terrain layer setup set new terrain setup layer from material select package it just means it's going to take from the material you got selected in the content browser so you click that give it a package name that's not already used help 321 that'll do it click OK and yes I want to create it now we got that done now if I want to use that material I click on it and then I put a padlock in there by clicking there and I'll just make the outer line a bit smaller and I'll make that a bit smaller too I don't want it to paint all over the place close the content browser now to paint it's just the same method paint with painting as it is raising and lowering hills just hold the control down left click with your mouse and it paints along and if you want to remove a bit that you went too far on just right click with your mouse and you can left click to put it back or go over it so I want it in the middle there we go alright that's enough for that tutorial uh, if you want to save the map you just go up there to file save as but before you save it you click this build button there It'll give you three errors that you haven't, you just ignore the three errors. Those three errors, like um, mobile platforms, you can ignore because it's for a PC. And you just click save, save as, give, oh, give it a name. Um, if you're making a CTF map, you just type CTF, put a minus sign and then the map name. And 
If you want vehicles in it, you put a V in front of the CTF. VCTF. And you just click save and that's it. Alright, thanks for watching. Uh.